Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to another episode of Planet Crafter where today we're hopping in and we are going to be building a new tree spreader. So I have unlocked tree spreader tier 2. I have been playing this for like 4 hours straight trying to get there. And let me show you guys something here. I've been playing this for 4 hours since the last video. Okay? Look at the percentage for insects. Are you kidding me? This is going to take absolutely forever. I have launched rockets after rockets after rockets. I have built new mining things. We'll get to that in a minute to try to get more items reproduced and stuff like that. I have done so much. I have been running around just trying to grind out items. My storages are friggin' full. But nonetheless, ooh, oh, you get built on land. <gasps> ooh, yes. Yes, you get built on land. Oh, that's so nice. Holy crap, the thing's huge. All right, so that's going to give plus 150 biomass, and let me put this in here. Plus 2.24 PPTs a second oxygen. So this was at 100, or like a billion or a million or something like that. Yeah, so it didn't go up that much. So those are nice. It's definitely going to help with the biomass, but it doesn't really help that much with oxygen. I'm going to need a lot more of those. The nice thing is I don't have to plant these on... Uh, on the water the planting them on the water kind of stunk that was kind of stinky I didn't like doing that it looks really cool though and all that's gonna go through and grow some trees for us wherever it's gonna grow the trees um no clue I'm sure we'll find there's one right there okay so we have some trees growing all right neat so I'm gonna need a lot more of those which means I'm gonna need a lot more zeolite I'm gonna need this is what it takes actually let me just go through it it takes zeolite fertilizer tier 2 tree barks bacteria samples and super alloys and right now I'm working on all of those so it's gonna be a little while zeolites the one thing that I'm kind of concerned about because it doesn't respawn on the trees look at this they it just it doesn't do it it doesn't come back so i so that's a very rare resource that i have to be careful with maybe i can find more of it somewhere i kind of want to head over to that mountain that's over there see that green mountain in the distance I bet you i can get there let me get some food let's go over there but yeah like i said i've put down a ton of different things for food for water for um to gather resources just a ton of different things because i wanted to get to the point where i'm comfortable with what i have and feel like that we're actually making progress somewhere so that's all of that that's going on right now let me grab an oxygen container and then we'll go on an adventure i always like to go on adventures with you guys because that to me seems a little bit more interesting than just watching me run in circles so I always enjoyed going on adventures with you guys so let's go we're gonna go all the way over there to that green mountain and hope that there's something over there because right now over in this area i've pretty much scrounged up everything that i could find i've consumed pretty much everything i'm just waiting now to be able to find new items and stuff and when you've gone through and played as much of the map that i have to be honest i just let the game sit i let my guy just cycle out of death repeatedly because I've done so much already, right? I've done so much that it's like, okay, well, now what? Because I've gotten a ton of the items. I've terraformed to this point. What do I do? Do I go build another base? So I'm at, like, a standstill right now with this game. Like, how much further do I really want to go with Planet Crafter? You know what I mean? I want to get everything for you guys. I want to be able to show off and say, yep, Sim did it all. He got everything for everyone. You know, I'm just going to grab it. And he did awesome, and he beat the whole game. But the fact that I let it sit... Literally, I'm going to have to like let it sit overnight for the insects to come through, I think. Which really bums me out, because I don't want to have it just sit overnight. I would rather do something and have fun with the game, but I just I feel like that there's just not a whole lot left. So that's why I'm like, you know what? I'm going on an adventure today. We're going to go all the way over here to these green mountains and just see what's over here. Although there are no resources over here, so I don't know if this was a good idea or not. Uh, there's literally nothing over here. It's red. Did I find the edge of the map? Is that what I did? Well, it's very red over here, but I, I don't think that I'm supposed to be over here yet, guys. 
Yeah, I'm not. I'm not thinking that this is somewhere I'm supposed to be. I think the game's like, hey, uh, you, you, you may just want to turn around. Uh, the fact that there's no resources or anything out here, uh, that's a pretty good key indicator that you're in the wrong spot and you need to turn around. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna turn around. We're gonna go back. Cause uh, I don't think that there's anything over here. Maybe there's a golden chest somewhere over here, but I'm not seeing it if it is. Um, as for golden chests, you guys have told me that there's 11 of them. I think I've only found six of them. So I have no idea where all the other ones are. Or is it? No, it's not meteoring outside. I thought maybe meteors were coming down. The home is that way. There's water over here. This is a big open space right here. You could build a pretty big base, I bet you. I'm just over here like, you know what? We're just going to explore the whole map now. Ooh, this place looks different. Oh, it is meteoring outside. Just not anywhere near me. Okay, here we go. Y'all so better grab this zeolite. So this area I've been to before. Or I haven't been to before. Have I? This looks different. I don't think I've been over here. Because my base is way over that way. No, this is way further to the east than I've ever been, I think. This place looks beautiful over here. Like all the trees and stuff. Looks like a good place where they could hide a good chest. Though there is a chest back here. That's nice. Ooh. Also, I always like to get a pulsar quartz. Ooh, and a fertilizer. Nice. I don't really need the uh, aluminum anymore. That changed between this episode and the last one. I don't need aluminum anymore. Um, I went through and was able to get a ton of aluminum. So I don't really need it anymore. I should build a small outpost over here. So I just have a place where I can build up and explore things. I'm going to need two titanium... Two silicone, two iron. Silicon. Sorry. Where even am I? I mean, I know that I'm still, like, around the map, right? But, like, seriously, where am I? There's no... I don't have any iron. Are you iron? No, you're titanium. Titanium, magnesium. Uh-oh. I need iron. Magnesium. There's some right there. Okay, good. I was starting to get worried there was just wasn't going to be any. So I started building these outposts in more areas because um, I think that it's good to have these around instead of just carrying a bunch of oxygen tubes with me. Because now this just unlocked this whole area for me to be able to explore more. This map is massive. I just found a new area that I've never been to. wonder if there's a new wreck over here. I'm just going to shoot up over here. See if there's anything. How deep's this water? Not bad, actually. I thought it was going to be deeper, but it's actually not bad. So where's home? Home is way over there. Okay. Hey, there's that wreck. There's That's the wreck that... Okay. So that's the last wreck that I found. I don't know if there's going to be another wreck over here. Holy explosive powder, thank you. I don't know, I'm just gonna grab it all. Grab it all, I'm gonna get the zeolite too. Like I said, rare resource, gotta grab it when you see it. Ooh, another one, and another one! Another chest. What do we got? More super alloy. Um. Also, I found a new plant. It was inside of a base, I found it. That is so pretty. Wait a minute. Yeah, that's the, that's the wreck I've been to before. I did find a new plant. It is like this pinkish plant. It looks really neat. Okay, this is an area that's not done yet because there's no resources. So I'm just going to go with when there's no resources, that means that zone's not complete yet. See, you can see over here all the resources and stuff that are already down. That's pretty much a telltale sign that, hey, we, we intend for you to come over here. 
What the heck is this? I just found a plant. Wait, is that the plant that I've been looking for this whole time? The black? It is! Auction multiplier 500%. Holy crap. I bet you it looks really neat too. I bet you if I put it in one of my planters to grow a bunch of it, it looks really cool. All right, where is my base? This way. Is this another one? This is another one. Uh-oh. I might run out of oxygen, which means I'll need to run all the way back over here. We're going to make it back as far as we can. I should make it pretty close. See, with how red this is, this, like, threw me off from going over there. I didn't know if this was somewhere I should have gone. But it definitely is somewhere I should have gone. That's really cool. I finally found the last plant in the game that I had been looking for that I couldn't find. So that's awesome. I have to travel for such a long distance to get back over there, though. I do have an outpost over there, though, just in case I ever need to go back. There is somewhere for me to return to over there, which is really good. Well, this is going to be my saving grace. If I can get inside of this building, I won't die. But right now, it's looking like it's going to start getting dark. Woohoo! I made it. <laughs> Victory is mine. All right, so you, I want you to grow one of these, please. I would like to take you out, and I want you to grow this, because I bet you that's just going to look cooler. So let's do that. Also, I did not know that there was going to be a tree that was going to build itself literally right in front of one of my staircases. Still, though, this looks really cool. Did you grow 100%? You're only at 51%? These trees are going to get 50% bigger? Holy cow, these trees are going to get massive. Heck yeah, dude. That's awesome. I bet you what I need to get to go up faster in order to get the insects to go up faster is my biomass. My biomass is not going up very fast at all. In comparison to my other ones, I probably need a lot of biomass. All right, let's see here. So in order to make this tree, the M Amora, I need plant volt volness. So let me put that in there. Right. I'm going to need some other stuff too, but for now we'll, we'll start with that. Um, let me put some things and stuff away. All right. So super alloy first. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. In random, I'm just going to toss all of this stuff. Very good. Aluminum needs to have my aluminum. Very good. Still fall more stuff over there. There's still more chests and stuff for me to find back in that area. So I'm going to have to go back over there. The unorganization, the unorganized manner of this right now is driving me absolutely insane. Now that I've gotten myself organized, for the most part in this game, when I'm not organized, it drives me insane. I look at it and I'm like, why? See, everything looks so good when it's organized. I mean, here, you want to see something that's really going to make your, your mind melt? Look at this. Look at the organization in here. It's terrible. Absolutely terrible. Don't go in there. That's, that's terrible, terrible organization. All right. Let's grab some water. Because I can now just drink. Ha ha. Perfect. Okay. What is next? Trying to build another one of these guys? Another one of these tree spreader tier 2s? I need fertilizer tier 2, but otherwise I have everything else. And I might have everything I need to make fertilizer tier 2. Because I know it's fertilizer. And some methane. And I want to say a squash. I think it's a squash. Is that what it is? And an algae. So I need another methane and an algae. 
Check this out. I got plenty of it right here. Hey, look, an oxygen capsule. Nice. I'm going to use that to go explore that area again. All right, so let's see here. Make this fertilizer tier two. Very good. Now to make this guy, I just need a bacteria sample, which I have on me a tree bark and a super alloy. Well, I just so happen to have a tree bark right here. And a super alloy is super duper easy as well. By the way, the, jig, the game is definitely starting to chug a little bit um, when running around and doing stuff. I've noticed that, that it's like, help, help. <laughs> it hurts. All right, so I'm going to build some trees right over here. This is where I'm going to build the next one. So put you down right there. And... I guess I'm going to go get this this one. So let me get you, please. Take this out. Deconstruct that. Yeah, I got another bacteria sample and some biomass. Nice. Bioplastic or whatever it is. All right. Now, inside of you, I'd like to put this tree. Nice. All right, now I should be able to grab a couple more things and like a sulfur. And I have that, which means I think I just need a methane and I can make a mutagen. And if I make a mutagen, I could get that tree with the plant volness done. Yep, there we go. And if I come over here. I can now slap this on in here. There we go. In you go. In you go. And research. And bada bing. Start sequencing. And we're good to go. All right. So we're going to make whatever this plant is. That tree. You see? You know, it makes me wonder. If I put a gold seed in there. If it would do anything. If it would make a special kind of tree. I don't think so. But I'm willing to try it. Oh, look at these plants. Those look awesome. We're really starting to kick up the amount of like trees and stuff that we're putting around here. Look at how big this freaking tree is. Holy crap. Are you done growing yet? Are you at 100% yet? Growth 76%. So you're still getting bigger? Yes, you are still getting bigger. Holy cow. Okay. Those are going to get massive. I like that. Okay, so in order to do that, I'm going to need another mutagen. So let's get another mutagen made. Okay, we'll grab that. I need some water. All right. And then I need to go here and go bacteria sample. Now I need sulfur and methane. Which I can get. So there's my methane. I'll just go grab a sulfur really fast. Grab you. Very good. So we're going to make the mutagen. I already have a tree bark. Let's just zip around over here. Grab that guy. And then go here. Make my mutagen. And then I just need... The gold plant... Which I'm thinking I could grab from right here. This is a lot. That's a big gamble, though. A golden seed is a big gamble for me. Are you done? No, you're 42% done. Okay. What else can we do for a small moment while we wait for that? 125. 125. 125. So all my trees right now are at 125. This other one I'm about to get is 150. So I need to start working on another tree spreader tier 2. So that's going to be another bacteria sample and another fertilizer. Which I can actually do. Because I just need one of these, right? One of... Ooh. I thought I had another fertilizer. I have bacteria sample already though. That's good. Um, fertilizer is sulfur and algae. 
and eggplants. Ooh, okay, I have eggplants growing. Okay, whoop, hop over here. I need a squash and another methane. Okay, so I have a squash. I need an algae and another methane, which I have another methane. Okay, let me grab that. Okay, so that should be fertilizer tier two. Now I'm gonna need a zeolite, which I have, a bacteria sample, so I can actually make this now. Okay, sweet. Let's go put down another one for this new tree. And we're gonna put that guy down over here. Put you down right there. All right. These trees are growing. How big are they going to get? This is at 22%. That's 22% of their size. So they're going to get four times that size. So yeah, those are going to get big. All right. Look at these trees. <laughs> That's so cool. This tree spreader is way cooler than the other one. I can't wait to see what the tree spreader tier three looks like. But that is so far away. I'm just going to have to let this game run like all day and just let it sit there and go and go and go and go and go. Are you done? 91%. We're almost there. Then I have this. I'll need another tree bark, which I should have one more of. I do. Yes. And I have this plant Orema. Now, I don't want to use it, but I will use it if the golden seed doesn't work. So we'll check with the golden seed. Uh, where is the golden seed? Is this the golden seed? For now, I'm just going to take this and put you in there so I can at least see what you look like. I think that's probably the rarer of the seeds, that purple one. It looked really cool, but I think it's probably the rarest of them. All right, I got the plant seed or tree seed Arema. All right, so let's try this. You did. All right, can, does that have a thing up there? Pelom. No, no, it doesn't. Okay, well, let's let's give it a go. We're going to let it go, and we'll see what happens. I don't know what percentage that's going to give me, but I'm going to go throw this out there, and then, guys, I think that this is probably where I'm going to leave this episode. Uh, maybe I'll wait. Maybe I'll... You know what? No. I'm going to hold for a second. I'm going to do some grinding. I'm going to build another tree planter because I want to see this tree, this this last tree with the golden seed. I want to do that in this episode. This is going to be the tier two tree episode. So I'll be right back, guys. Let me get some more ingredients and I'll be right back with you guys. Hey, okay. So I got myself my plant. It is 200% seed. I don't actually know how to pronounce that, but it's seed something holy crap these trees are huge <laughs> look at this one too these ones are getting big i died over here because <laughs> my hydration and stuff was really low okay so i have a fertilizer i need to make a fertilizer tier two i need to get some food because my guy's dying it's very dark i just kind of like let it sit for a minute um instead of doing any resource grinding i'm like i'm just gonna let it sit and see what happens and uh, i died that, that that's what happened all right, eat the beans. All right, that's an oxygen capsule, not a water capsule. So I'm just going to run over here. This game gets so dark. And then it there's like no way to actually light it up. I think what I'm going to do maybe is just start going around with... Um, with what is it? These... Uh, these. I think I'm just going to start going around with these and just putting them up everywhere so I can see where I'm going. Because right now it's so hard to see anything when it gets dark outside. Okay, what else did I need? I need a zeolite. Do I have one? Yes. All right, perfect. So I have a zeolite. I'm going to need a bacteria sample. Got one. I'm going to need a super alloy. Got one. I'm going to need a squash. And algae and methane. Okay, good. It's starting to light up outside. All right, so let's grab a couple methane. Should have at least one squash left. Yep, perfect. And a couple algae. And make this fertilizer tier two. 
And now I should have everything I need to build this, right? Oh, I need a tree bark. Okay. I should have one now. Because we let it sit for a minute. Yes. Perfect. Everything's going so good. It's so good. It's so good. I like how good everything's going. Okay, let's build this guy right here. This looks like a great place for this new seed. All right, so that's giving me plus 3.9 biomass, 140 growth, 1%. It's, we're going to have to just kind of let that guy grow for a minute. Look at these trees. Look at these trees. These trees are going to be huge. How big are you? 81%. Look at these. Holy cow. And these ones... These are definitely like palm trees. That's really cool. So this is 50%. So these are going to get 50% bigger. That's going to look awesome. Look at them. They're all the way over here too. These trees are everywhere. This game is so incredibly cool. It's ridiculous. All right. Where's my first trees for this one? Come on. I know you want to. Where are you? Come out, come out, tiny trees. Where are you? Took a whole golden seed to make you, so... Thankfully, it was worth it. The trees are awesome. But... Where are they? Where is it? I, oh, there they are. That looks like... More than one type of tree. That is more than one type of tree. Is there any more? They're so small over there. Oh yeah, here we go. <laughs> I can watch trees grow. There you go, guys. Here's what we're going to do for the rest of the episode. I'm just kidding. That would be incredibly boring. I don't want to do that. Okay. So I think, though, guys, that this is probably going to do it for today. We have done a ton of progress, right? We have huge trees now, huge forests growing. I have found some new plants. I found a new area. We have a golden seed that turned into a tree. Look at this. Oh my lord, it's so pretty. Um, we have so many new things in here now. It's, it's so unreal. What's our biomass and everything looking like? Dang. That is going up actually pretty darn quick. I like that. I'm still going to need more pressure and more heat at some point because those aren't going up nearly as fast. The biomass is finally starting to kick up. What's our mosquitoes looking like? 1%. Yes. <laughs> we made it to 1% now. Oh my lord. So much effort for 1%. That's ridiculous. All right. So guys, I think that this is where I'm going to leave this one. Thank you everybody so much for watching this one. When you guys come back, I'm going to try to turn all of uh, maybe the seed pestras. Is there a plant that comes with seed pestra? A tree that comes with seed pestra? Which one comes with seed pestra? This one. Tree Atalus. So maybe I'm going to make like six of these and just go put them in different spots around the map. Um, I'm going to need more energy, but thankfully I've gotten plenty of uh, this... Uh, the, whatever you call this stuff. The pulsar quartz. I think I actually have enough to almost make another uh, fusion reactor. I could actually make another one of these, and I'm probably going to need it with the number of trees that I'm going to be putting down. But yeah, I'm going to go through. I'm going to make six more of these tree spreaders, too. While I'm waiting for tree spreader three, we are going to be getting there. When I come back in the next episode, guys, we will have tree spreader three. It's going to take me probably all day today. I'm just letting this sit in order to unlock that. But I will get there. We will see this in the next episode. So thank you, everybody, so much for watching this one. If you guys liked it, hit that like button for me. Let me know you guys want to see more. Also, please don't forget to subscribe and leave me a comment down below. And as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.